Drama off the field before tonight's game. The league handed down a punishment for Astros first baseman Yuli Gurriel after his racially insensitive behavior directed at Dodgers pitcher Yu Darvish in game three. But not everyone is happy with baseball's decision. Our live team coverage continues with KCAL 9's Lori Perez live outside Dodger Stadium with more on this controversy tonight. Lori. Elsa and Peter are looking for reaction tonight. We found a die-hard Dodger fan in Torrance. He came here from Japan in 1979, and when we he asked him about what happened, he shook his head sadly. Inside his tiny sushi shop, Chef Shozozawa says he listens to 162 games a year on this portable stereo. Year-round, seven days a week of work, punctuated by the highs and lows of the game. A passion that began when Hideo Nomo signed with the boys in blue, and Mr. Sawa got the first of a still-growing collection of baseball bobbleheads. The sports swag now covers his Torrance restaurant. 1994, that I started at Nomomania. He'll tell you his English needs work. Uh, before, it used to be that TV game, but I couldn't hear the customer's order. My wife is uh, angry. They moved to another place in the TV, the only radio. But, but he had no trouble understanding when he heard and saw Yuli Gurriel making this gesture and using a Spanish slur referring to Dodger pitcher and Japanese born Yu Darvish. Major League player, eh, like Trump is saying, oh my. As a Japanese immigrant and a sports fan, he doesn't think it's right. Guriel's punishment starts next year. An opinion shared by other notable fans, including Rob Lowe, who tweeted, Yeah, those critical spring games really send a stern message. Actor Daniel Day Kim, after Guriel said he didn't mean to do anything offensive, posted, Yes, because we all know that doing this to an Asian is a universal sign of respect. And NBA player Jeremy Lin, who knows a thing or two about facing racial taunts in sports, after Darvish accepted Guriel's apology, tweeted, that's real, respect. And reaction was swift on social media. Darvish himself releasing a statement saying, let's stay positive and move forward. Back to you.